Hi, my name is Jen. I'm a digital artist and the face behind Gold Eevee here on the internet. That I have never done a TikTok OC challenge. And I think they started coming around in like 2019 or 2020. And I've never done one. So today, that is what we are gonna do. I'm gonna be starting with the opposite OC challenge. It's time for the opposite OC challenge. Their eye color is whatever your least favorite color is. The skin color is the color of your least favorite food. If it's daytime where you are, make a night in your drawing. And if it's nighttime, make a day. If you prefer cold weather or hot weather, have your OC live in the opposite climate. And if you have short hair, give them long hair and vice versa. Okay, artists, let's see your character. Does this mean I'm gonna have to make a background? I don't want to make a background. This is supposed to be quick and easy. I don't want to make a background. Okay, let's start with the eye color in skin color. Block in the shapes with the flat brush. Um, and it's it's in the painting section. Their eye color is whatever your least favorite color is. Eye color. A few moments later. Like a hot, hot pink, hot neon pink. I really, really do not like neon pink or anything that is neon pink. The only pinks that I like are like Salmon, like salmon pink. Nice, juicy salmon pink. The skin color is the color of your least favorite food. I don't, I don't think I have a, I don't think I have a food that I hate. I should have thought of this beforehand. Eventually. I really don't like butternut squash. Butternut squash or any kind of squash. Mm -mm, I don't like it. I've had it before in soups, and I absolutely love sweet things. Um, I absolutely love desserts and cakes and things, but I cannot stand butternut squash soup. I, I can't eat it. If anybody asks me to eat it, I will not eat it. I cannot eat butternut squash. Mm -mm, mm -mm, can't do it. And run with it, and if I need to change it later, I will. I have a thing with eyes. I usually need to change them. But let's continue. I am. I'm giving my character. Giving my character arms. Like that's that's where we're at. So like I was saying. I don't like butternut squash. I have never liked butternut squash. I will probably never enjoy butternut squash. It's even worse than I thought. Like, I'm looking at it. I'm looking at it on my laptop because I have like 15 s screens open right now. I've got this, I've got that, I've got this. I'm too many screens. Whatever really cool features they have, and I can I can just feel the character designers um, like quietly screaming. If it's daytime where you are, make a night in your drawing, and if it's nighttime, make a day. Okay, uh, it's a weird in between because we are starting summer right now. They said make it night, so I'm gonna make it like really dark. Oh, this is revealing all of my sins. Oh my God. If you prefer cold weather or hot weather, have your OC live in the opposite climate. I really like cold weather. There's this really cute dress, very cute. baby doll style dress and if you have short hair give them long hair and vice versa okay artists let's see your character 
if you have short hair then long hair if you have long hair give them short hair well i'd probably this would probably be classified as um long hair by most people even though when i think of long hair i don't think of i don't think my hair is particularly long better and i like where this hair is going but like i feel like half the time i have to tell myself with the hair to rein it in because i break physics with hair i either make it too big or too poofy um and for this My companion has left me. He has disappeared. I don't think he'll be coming back.
So I have finally gotten to the point where I am almost done. I have to fix the lantern and then after that I'm going to be adding my highlights and maybe like one or two more details to the eye. Hey, this is Editing Jen. Um, I just noticed my footage cut out right before I was about to do the big reveal and close out my video and do an outro. This is the end of the video. I learned a lot, I had a great time, and this is the final result. Also, I've noticed recently I've been getting a lot of love on my Inktober pieces that I posted here as YouTube Shorts. Thank you so, so much for all the love and support that I've been getting on those. They made me really smile. Uh, thank you so much for watching. I was torn into, I was built anew.